What's up guys and welcome back to the life of Kevin. Now if you remember last episode, Kevin's party was pretty successful. I think it was a pretty good time and uh, he, he caught the attraction of a very lovely looking lady, uh, Emma. So this episode, I want to see if Kevin can uh, make Emma his girlfriend because they're, they're only an acquaintance right now. But I think there's a couple problems with that. So starting off, as you can see, Kevin's getting a little bit pudgy. When we started this game, Kevin had washboard abs. He was completely ripped. <laughs> and now he's getting a little bit flabby because he spent the first two days in the neighborhood doing nothing but eating cake, uh, eating craft dinner, and drinking. So yesterday, Kevin went on Amazon and ordered himself a home gym. So what we're going to do to start off this episode is we're going to get Kevin back into shape, and then we're also going to find Kevin a job. So... Nobody wants to date some unemployed bum. Kevin needs to find himself a good job, and then when he's all set up and he's back to being the specimen he was, then uh, we'll give Emma a call and see if we can uh, woo her. Come on, Kevin, you can do it. Come on, lift that weight. We need to get you ripped, huge, jacked, Tyrannosaurus flex. Alright, that's enough, Kevin. We have been working out forever. Nothing. Really, not even so much as a single ab. Nothing. Oh my god, man, this is gonna take forever. I don't know what we're gonna do, Kevin. Oh! Okay, I got an idea. Uh, reward store. Yeah, okay. So there's, like, there's rewards for having done things in the game, like, um, doing achievements, I guess. And we got a bunch from our party, and we got a bunch from meeting neighbors. So we have 750 points. So let's see if there's something here that can make Kevin muscular again. We want him to be huge. No, no, no. Come on, Kevin, there's got to be something here to help us out. Gym rat? Gym rat. Don't lose hygiene while exercising. Well, that's useless. We need you to be big again. We need you to be muscular. Oh, here we go. Insta-large. All right. Become a bigger you, Kevin. Okay, here we go. Drink. All right, Kevin. Time to get huge again. Whew. Yeah. Did it work? Didn't do anything. Hibana. What? Oh, a bigger you. No, 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 Kevin, you're a whale. This is going to take forever. To oh, look at your back. <laughs> what have I done to you, Kevin? This is why you don't do drugs, kids, because you never know what's going to do to you or magic potions. Like, we were having a hard enough time just getting him to get that six-pack back. How are we going to lose the keg and then get a six-pack? I don't know what to do. What do you think, disembodied YouTube voice? Well, come on, give me something. Training montage. You can do it, Kevin. Lift that weight. Stay hydrated, Kevin.
Evan! You specimen. I knew you had it in you, kid. Well, that took forever, but Kevin is now back to his usual self. He's a little bit uncomfortable. I think he's, uh, let's see, fatigued. Fatigued from working out. But that's okay, Kevin. You deserve a little break. So, it's a little bit late at night. Maybe we should try to find a job now. Find job. I have no idea what the jobs are like in this game, so I'm really curious as to what Kevin is going to be. <laughs> I wonder if they have brain surgeon. Kevin, Kevin's the type to be a brain surgeon. Okay. So, we have painter, tech guru, writer, athlete, culinary, secret agent, business, criminal, astronaut, or entertainer. Not very many mundane jobs in The Sims anymore. I remember you used to be able to be like a cook and a firefighter and normal things, not like secret agent and astronaut. I'm leaning towards athlete. After uh, after all that hard work, Kevin is uh, he's in athletic shape. I think he'd make a good hockey player. An athlete requires physical strength, check, speed, check, endurance, check, and intelligence. Start a career where enthusiast fans will shout your name, wear your jersey, and remember your feats forever. Career branch professional athlete or and bodybuilder. Okay, so I think you could be one or the other. Now hiring as a water boy? Man. I'm just not going to want to date a water boy, Kevin, but I guess all of these palette cleaner, live chat support, writer's assistant. Yeah, so you start off as like the crappiest job ever for all of these. Assistant dishwasher? I think that'll work. You'll be a professional hockey player. We did it. So I think today Kevin is actually going to go to work, because I have a feeling if you don't show up to work on the first day, it's probably not a good thing. You're not going to go from water boy to uh, first liner in the NHL by not showing up to work. And then tomorrow, uh, we'll call up Emma and see if she wants to go on a date. See if we can get Kevin a girlfriend by the end of this episode. Isn't that right, Kevin? Please don't burn this house down. Michael Jackson don't live here. Living the life, Kevin. I swear something, when he eats, something just turns off in his head. Something just switches off, and he will sit there for an hour just smiling at nothing. Like, right now, I think he is... He's smiling at the stove. That's another thing we need to improve on, Kevin. Maybe you can practice dancing? I don't know if that's a skill or not, but at the very least... I don't know, you gotta get better somehow, right? Work for Kevin starts in about an hour. Oh, crap. Have a good first day at work, Kevin. Good luck. We'll be praying for you. Kevin is off to work. And this is why I didn't want to get him a job right away, because now I have seven hours of just hanging out. Whoa. While working in the locker room, Kevin noticed that the team's star player is clearly walking with a limp when no one else is looking. Should Kevin report the apparent injury to the trainer? Oh, man, I didn't know that kind of stuff came up with work. So is Kevin going to be a snitch or let the guy play it out? What do I do? Okay, um, report it. Kevin explained the situation and the trainer orders some tests. The players had a partially torn ligament and Kevin may have saved someone a potentially career-ending injury. Performance gained small. Way to go, Kevin. Yeah, we made the right choice. Kevin brought home $112 today. He did some superb work today. Way to go, Kevin! Oh, and a zook. And a yeah. Zook. And you're flirty. You're ready for your date tomorrow. Flirty heart cookies? No. We're staying away from the cookies and the cakes. We went through all that work. You are gonna have a salad. You're having a you're having a salad, Kevin. Today is today's Sunday. No, Kevin, you have work today? God damn it. I thought yesterday was Saturday and, ah, uh, Okay, so we have another day of work, and then we can go out with Emma. Bye, Kevin, good luck! Okay, we're gonna work hard again today. Kevin got promoted to locker room attendant! Oh, right! Oh, he's bored. He had, he had a rough day. Up at 4 a.m. again, the crack of dawn. All right, Kevin, we're gonna get food. And then we're going on a date. Lunch. I thought he was going to burn the house down there. Kevin, 
<laughs> You're so good at cooking. How do you still start fires? I don't understand. And if that was the worst, um, the worst stove in the game, we would have definitely caught the house on fire. I have no doubt in my mind that we would have just burned the place Can down. On ask on date. Is that gonna work? Yeah, we can ask her on a date. All right. It's six in the morning, Kevin. But crap, crap, crap. We didn't. We didn't change. Hopefully, we don't show up to this date in our underwear. Where are we going? So we can go to the park, to the bar. We're not going to the bar at six a.m. We're not going to the gym anymore. The solar flare lounge or a museum. Now, some people were asking me last episode. Um, who Emma Yager is because we have so many celebrities and like famous characters and things like that who Emma Yager is and I googled Emma Yager and I don't think she exists I'm pretty sure she's actually designed to be like the perfect woman so like I looked at her characteristics she's smart she's funny she's artistic she's everything so Kevin's gonna have a really hard time making this work but I believe in him and I think she's gonna want to go to a museum so Kevin, you are going to have to put on your make-believe face because I don't think he knows anything about museums or art, but we'll do our best. Kevin, please show up to the state dressed. Please, please have clothes on. Yeah, Kevin has clothes on. Hello, Emma. <laughs> oh, okay, there's like challenges like the party. Okay, I need to pause. I need to read this. Uh, main goal, socialize with your date. Okay, flirt with your date three times, sit and talk to your date once. Bizarre and then we can day. get a, a good date, so. Let's give her the old triple flirt, Kevin. Three flirts in a row, Kevin. See if this works. If you can pull this off. We were just blocking the entrance to this place. I think she's into it. Why is everybody hanging out in the bathroom? Like... Mr. Popo, Leonardo DiCaprio, and a couple randoms are in one bathroom stall talking to each other. Come on, Emma. We're, we're doing things together, aren't we? Okay, I think she's coming in now. Oh my god, Kevin, she's like you. She's just... She's got no attention span. Okay, we need to go socialize with her outside. Pickup line. Okay, stop looking. Kevin, you don't actually care about this stuff. You're supposed to make it up with her in front of you. Uh, Pick up line. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> I think that went over well. Is there a place? Sit and talk to your date. I don't think there's any place to sit. No, Kevin. I've been working out, you know. This is going well. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> That was unexpected. That wasn't a passionate kiss, though, Kevin. You gotta put more passion into it. Whoa. Kevin, she's bringing up the woohoo. Is this gonna be a first date woohoo? I don't know about this. Is there, like, a certain amount of time to this date, I wonder? I can't... Oh, there's only two hours left. Okay, so we actually have... Oh, she's gonna go take a dump, Kevin. So we can actually go inside now. Well, on the upside, she doesn't seem to give two craps about anything going on in this museum. She's all about Kevin, so this is going well. All right, charisma. We can't sit down and talk to our date because there's nowhere to sit. Can we sit over here? Yes, sit together, sit together. Go, go, go. Mission success. We've, we've found a bench. We're leaving the museum and we're going next door to... I don't even know. Look both ways when you cross the street, Kevin. Where are you going? Kevin, where are you going? Do they really go all the way around and cross on a crosswalk? Wow. That's it. Yeah, look at the lean on Kevin. Oh my god, you absolute stallion. Do you know any stories? Funny. Okay. Just do it, Kevin. Just ask her to be your girlfriend. Wiva? Uh, Yaffa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Snurgs! Selfie! Yay! Kevin, you did it! <laughs> Storm of Flame. God, her hair is annoying. You can only see half her face half the time. Oh, what do you mean, thumbs down? What do you mean, bad Kevin? <laughs> Quiffed! <laughs> 
What is happening right now? No, no, don't, don't. Oh, Kevin, you, you idiot. He just tried to flirt, to give a flirty introduction to Summer Holiday. That's why she just lost her mind. Whoa. Here we go. There you go, Kevin. Show her you're the one. Silver medal, Kevin. <laughs> Like cupcakes, we do. Try making some with the Cupcake Factory? You can get a Cupcake Factory in this? <laughs> no, that's a bad idea. Because if Kevin gets a cup... What? Bills have just been delivered to your mailbox. You owe $3,300 and have 48 hours to pay it before they shut uh -huh. off your utilities one by one. Uh -huh. What? Kevin, what have you been doing for $3,300? Kevin, you've been here for th four days. He's lived in the neighborhood four days, and his house has so far cost him $3,300 in bills. You are going to have to climb up the uh, socioeconomic ladder, Kevin. Your job is going to need to get a lot better than a water boy or locker room supervisor or whatever you are right now. Well, that's going to be it for this episode, guys, and I'm really happy with this. I think it's good that we improved on Kevin. We brought him back to the peak of physical shape and that we... Uh, Proved on his dancing a little bit, maybe? We got him a job, and we got him a girlfriend. So I think Kevin's pretty well set up in this neighborhood now. Kevin, I just turned that off. Can you stop? I'm trying to do my outro here, guy. Oh, she's outside, Kevin! What is she doing here? I'm trying to do my outro, and she's just showing up. Uh, invite in. Oh, cool. Papa. Look at that, Kevin. Bye you didn't even have to call her. She's just coming over. Did she really just show up to say she needs to go to bed? Well, like I was trying to say, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.